Hey there, DevOp folks. Struggling to choose between Datadog and Sentry for your monitoring apps? Let's break it down. First up, we have Datadog. It's a comprehensive observability platform for DevOps and IT teams. It unifies metrics, logs, and traces, offering real-time insights into infrastructure, application performance, and security. With over 600 integrations, it's great for monitoring cloud-scale systems, databases, and servers. Datadog's dashboards are customizable, and its alerting is flexible but can be complex to set up. Pricing starts at around $15 per month per host, but costs can add up for large deployments. Now, Sentry. This tool is all about error tracking and crash reporting. It's developer focused, providing real time error alerts with detailed stack traces, user contacts, and code level insights. Sentry integrates with 65 plus tools, is easy to set up, and offers a generous free tier. Pricing starts at around $26 per month for teams with transparent costs and spike protection. However, its scope is narrower, focusing mainly on application errors. So, how do they compare? Datadog is your go to for full stack observability. Think complex microservices or large infrastructures. It's feature rich but pricier and has a steeper learning curve. Sentry shines for error tracking, offering simplicity and deep debugging for developers. It's cost effective for smaller teams, but lacks broad infrastructure monitoring, which is better. If you need holistic system monitoring, choose Datadog. For laser focused error tracking and quick debugging, Sentry's your pick. Assess your team's needs, complex systems or app stability, and you'll know what fits. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more tech tips, and I'll see you in the next one.